ready for fans anonymous. I know I am. Hey, hey, hey. It's obvious, tune into Phantoms Anonymous They talk about everything from Batman to Pocahontas Leave you in astonishment, let be the Mario Odyssey is going down, girls and boys, pick up your phone and follow me Malcolm's always delivering, just like Domino's The newest breaking news, like who just got the new movie role So get a snack and relax your toes It's time to get the knowledge from the pros Let's go <laughs> Boom! Warner Brothers, what is your problem? Y'all already know. Welcome to the episode of Fandom Anonymous. Apparently, Henry Cavill is out as Superman. There is no more Henry Cavill Superman. And the reason being is because Warner Brothers has decided to go with a Supergirl movie that would not make sense for the age of Superman to be who he is. Because, if you know, Kara went off first. You know, she went off first. And then Kal-El got uh, lost or however. So she should be a little bit older. The age, there should be some disparity in age. And... Yeah, it's just a lot of mess, and Henry Calvin's going off to be the in The Witcher, and it's just a little big mess. And Henry Calvin said, "Look, I'm not gonna do it." Warner Brothers like, "Well, we don't need you." And there's no more Henry Calvin Superman family and friends. <laughs> Warner Brothers, you've done it again. You're just so just so excellent. What is the problem at Warner Brothers? Why can I not get it together? I sound real country when I just said that. Why can they not get it together? You literally just lost an integral piece. You already lost Ben Affleck. And it hasn't quote unquote been confirmed, but just go ahead and call it quits. Uh, and now you've lost Henry Calvo. Henry Calvo's like, hey, I got money to make. I got a family to feed. I don't think he's married to have kids, but he, he has family at the end of the day. He has to take care of himself. You can't be waiting around for me to put on the blue and red spandex and cape, you know? No! It, hey, it is what it is. Now, do I hate to see this? Yes, because do I like Henry Cavill as Superman? Yes. Is this a horrible decision on Warner Brothers' part? Yes. Is it Henry Cavill's fault? No. He was there. He was available to do this, do whatever they asked him to do as far as next movies are concerned. They decided to go in a different direction of what they're going to do as far as their universe is concerned. If you can even still call it a universe with these separate Joker movies and the Shazam over here, they were waiting on him to do a cameo for Shazam, but that fell through. And it's just a big mess as it always is at Warner Brothers. Do I like coming to you all to report this mess at Warner Brothers? No, because I want these movies to be successful because I like DC just as much as I like Marvel. Now, I'm a DC Pops up top there. You know, shout out to my DC Pops. I got them sitting here. I have more DC shirts than I have Marvel shirts. A lot of people think that I just bash DC. I hate DC. No, I like DC. But I at least want DC to be credible and to also have a game plan. And right now, their cars are showing big time that they don't know what they're doing right now. And somebody really needs to step in there and turn things around. What do you guys think about this news that Henry Cavill is out as Superman? Let me know in the comments below whether you watch this on YouTube or Facebook. We will see you guys in another video. Check it, it's Phantoms Anonymous in the spot Gonna let you know what's poppin', let you know what's hot About all the different cons, movies, and TV shows Funko Pops, games, and more, whoa, so here we go <laughs> From Marvel to DC, Transformers like Bumblebee We got all your fandom needs, so sit back and relax And enjoy the views, leave a like and subscribe Check in on Facebook to stay tuned